Hey, some I just wanted to sh uh, show you this. I just found this myself. I watched your video, and it got me to wondering if any of my Suriname cherries made it back. Because every one of my Suriname cherries got ate the day I planted them. You sent me some plants, they all got killed instantly. And so, I didn't have any. And in fact, the white sweet potato you gave me, I planted it, and it got ate down to the ground, first day. So I'm going to show you what I did. But those are two that just I just found. I didn't even know I had those two there. I know this is shaky, but it's the best I can do. Uh. Here's my tree that's still on the ground from the last great hurricane. But anyways, I went out and I got a cage from out of the garden and I put it over where the sweet potato had been because I knew the potato had to still be under the ground. And it actually came back. Of course, it's been, we've been getting cold weather, so it's kind of dying back for the year. But there it is. There's my sweet potato. And not only that, but I planted a bunch of the seeds in here from those surname cherries that were just seeds. And I don't know if you can see it. There's one, two, three, and four. So I know I got six Suriname cherry trees growing here. And uh, and they're inside this cage. And I'm not going to move that cage until it starts uh, causing problems. But that's it. Just want you to see the progress of everything. I don't know that any of the Suriname cherries came back that got eight because I don't think they really have the ability to recover from something like that. But these are seeds, the, the seeds you sent me. All right, bye-bye.